In Breckenridge, Colorado, master distiller Jordan Vi knows the secret to creating award-winning hooch is getting high. High in elevation, that is. By our research and our best estimation, we are the distillery operating at the highest altitude uh, in the world. If there is a small Swedish man somewhere in the Alps that would like to contest that, we encourage him to come forward. The Breckenridge Distillery is the first and only one of its kind in Summit County. So why choose a location that's never been used to distill before? Summit County has a few unique characteristics that, that make it uh, particularly well suited to, uh, to distillation. Um, first and foremost is, is the fantastic water we have up here. Uh, the snow melt water very high in, uh, in, in calcium, magnesium, has a, has a good hardness level. Um, makes for a very almost sweet, uh, luscious addition to, to your final product. Uh, it pairs very well with, uh, with the type of grain spirit that we're using. The uh, altitude that we have up here, the temperature of the water that comes naturally off of, uh, out of the pipes is, is very low. Um, so this, this still actually operates at a lower temperature than it would at sea level uh, by a good 15 to, 15 to 18 degrees. So it's uh, lower energy consumption to, to achieve the same process. And the cooling water that we use in the condensing part of the operation is a lot more efficient because it's coming off the pipes here naturally at about 50 degrees. The distillery is focusing on vodka, a three-year bourbon, and a single malt whiskey that's on a four to six year aging regimen. Each week, three to four barrels of whiskey are produced, all of which are overseen by Jordan, and if that weren't enough, in his downtime, he has a few side projects going on. I am working on a line focused on local fruits uh, and botanicals, uh, things that are indigenous to Summit County. Um, not a whole lot grows up here. Everything seems to, to be on a shrubbery, but we have gooseberries, uh, currants to work with, which I intend to infuse and do some, some limited releases of our vodka infused with uh, gooseberry and, uh, and one with currant. We're also doing a line of liqueurs um, based on those, and I found some incredible herbs and botanicals up in the mountains here. Uh, short hikes have yielded things like uh, genipe, which is uh, a, an herb of the Artemisia family, uh, very common in, in the mountains of Italy, uh, but I've never really seen it done anywhere else, and definitely not domestically. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to working with some infusions of the genipe that, that just seems to grow wild everywhere here. Complimentary tastings of the Breckenridge Distillery's award-winning products are offered in their downtown tasting room six days a week. It's a real labor of love. I mean, you, you uh, try to push a simple grain or fruit or herb uh, just to its, its, its peak of, of flavor expression and, and find a perfect balance between all the different components of it. And uh, it's equal parts science and and art, I guess, so it's, uh, it's not a bad way to spend your day. That's why I do it.